we've seen some major updates on the test site, which usually means a push to live within days. Here we can see it's not just the styling that's changed, but a little bit of the functionality too. For example, you can see the how to, news and support buttons have all made it to the main navigation bar, whereas before we used to have to go back to the landing page to use them. The game activity link has also joined them instead of floating to the right. We can also see the map tools have had a bit of a refresh with a drop down add-in and the search bar moving over to the left. We also have the Ego Sim and Hollow building selections in with the other map views now instead of being icons on the map. The drop down menu has also had its styling updated but it's caused an error where the last game feed notification lays over the top until you scroll down. We can also see new resources shown when the tiles are selected. This could be a sign we're getting additional resources soon, however there doesn't seem to be any updates to the resources section where I presume these would be displayed. My only annoyance with the update is the number balances in the top right seem rather squished and aren't as easy to read at first glance. Hopefully that will be addressed before it's pushed live. Have you guys spotted anything else new that I've missed? Let me know in the comments below. As always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have an amazing day.